Sometimes checking our email can be such a daunting task just based on the sheer number of emails that pass through our inbox every day. So this is the first of two videos that will show you how to organize your inbox um, just a little bit more so that it is not such a difficult task. Um, the first thing that you can do is use what I'm going to show as important, starred, and labels. And important are these little yellow arrows right here. And by and large, I have not chosen what is important. Google has, based on my reading history, my reply history, and the like. So when they notice that I have a lot of con um, contact or I, I reply to or read this particular uh, email a lot, they mark it as important from here on out so that I can always see what's marked as important. Now I can say um, this actually wasn't important. I can uncheck it. Um, likewise, if something is important that, sh that isn't tagged, I can click on it and now it will become important. Now the nice thing about this is that over on the left here, there's inbox, starred, and important. If I click on important, just those conversations that have been tagged with the yellow important arrow will pop up. So now it makes it much more easier to filter through the things that either I or Google has deemed as important. The second thing, and you'll notice that some of these are tagged with a little yellow star, and these are conversations that I have starred, things that I want to get back to quickly, things that are important to me, and you can make something um, starred just by simply clicking on it, and you can and click on it again to, to unstar it. And just like with important, you can click on starred over here on the left, and it brings up just those conversations that I've marked as starred um, that I want to easily access and get back to. The other thing that you can do is you can um, label specific things. So if I click on this one, for example, right now it's um, labeled priority, but I can also assign additional labels to it. You'll notice that when I clicked on this, these additional um, options popped up. So here's labels, and right now these are the labels that I have made. Um, I could label it, I could unlabel it as priority and instead put it under Northwest Service Club classes or under JDRF or whichever is most important. It actually fits under, under Google Apps. And I can hit apply. Now I can also, if I choose, um, create new labels on the fly. So if I just check a conversation and right here I can create a new label uh, and label as anything I want. Now over on the left, these are the labels that I have set up. If I click on any one of these, then just the things that I have labeled with Google Apps will come up. And you can see here now, G these are just things that are labeled with the label Google Apps. If I click on JDRF, just those conversations that I've marked with JDRF will come up. Okay, so those are ways that you can kind of, you know, prioritize your inbox on your own. You can use stars, labels, or um, uh, the important button. So I hope that is helpful. Um, to find out more about configuring your inbox um, so that it does some things automatically for you, you can watch the next video.